Welcome. We're having a look at percentages now. This is a short percentages video series. The first video we're going to look at is percentages change to decimals, converting percentages into decimals. So to convert percentages to decimals, the rule is we uh, divide by 100. Now dividing by 100 involves moving the decimal point two places to the left. So we'll identify where the decimal point is and we'll look to move that decimal point two places to the left to turn a percent into a decimal. So let's have a look at a few examples. We want to turn 43% into a decimal. Now 43 is a whole number and so the decimal would come just after the 3 if we had to put it in. We don't write it in normally, but um, it, we can think of that decimal point as being just after the units column. So that's where it is, and we want to be moving that decimal point two places to the left in order to convert a percentage to a decimal. So that decimal point is, has moved uh, to just the left of the tens column, just to the left of the 4. And uh, when we write that in, just to make sure everyone is clear that that is a decimal, we'll pop an extra zero on just before the decimal point. So 43% has turned into 0.43. So we can follow that pattern there, whereby the decimal point has been moved from after the numbers to just before the first digit here, and uh, we can see that 17% would turn into 0.17. So those first two, those two digits of the original percentage in a two-digit percentage, they go, they just get turned into being straight after the decimal point when the percentage is turned into a decimal. Just have a look at another slight variation here, and that's when you've got a single-digit percentage, like 8%. Now once again, with 8%, the decimal point is actually invisibly put just straight after the, uh, the 8. And so if we move that two places to the left in order to turn it into a decimal, we can see that it will move across to the left two places past the 8, and it actually leave a bit of a gap to the left of the 8 where the tens column would be if we had a digit in the tens column. And so what we've got to do is to fill in some spaces with zeros one for where the tens column would be in, an, in a two-digit percentage and another zero out the front of the decimal for a similar reason as we added a zero to the left-hand side of the first couple of examples there. So 8% turns into 0.08. So we've got a bit of a pattern here. Two-digit two percentages turn into 0. and then the two digits straight after that. Uh, Single-digit percentages end up being 0.0 in this case. Let's have a look at one more example. 3%, I think you can see it'll work a lot like the 8 did. We'll end up with, I think, 0.03 and there we have it there. So that uh, hopefully allows you to get the hang of how we turn percentages into decimals. Let's just recap. To convert percentages into decimals, we divide by 100 and effectively that means we are looking to move the decimal point two places to the left. Hope that helps you convert percentages to decimals. Thanks for listening. See you next time.